welcome student in standard 5th today we will begin our new chapter in environmental studies part 2 lesson number 4 evolution module 1 so student in this lesson we will be learning about the changes in plants birds and animals due to environmental and natural disasters on your screen you can see the picture how the changes occur on the earth the image give us the idea how the earth is formed and how the evolution of human begin occur how the sun form and because of that earth form this picture give us the idea of the different stages of evolution and also explain us properly that how the evolution of human took place from the explosion sun still the formation of human as we are studying the evolution chapter it is necessary for us to know how the event took place in a proper order and this image explain us properly that how all that events took place as you see how at different stages a new species took birth and lead to another different species and like that how the human begin are form so let's study in detail of them in our chapter evolution learning objectives the meaning of evolution the theory of charles darwin various species of dinosaur fossils of dinosaurs species of dinosaurs evolved into birds and stages of evolution the concept of evolution student what is evolution let's see the word evolution is generally understood to mean gradual and continuous changes evolution also defines as descent with modification means species changes over time to time give rise to new species and shares a common ancestors all life on earth is connected and related to each other and this diversity of life is a product of modification of population by natural selection where some traits were favored in environment over other but due to change in environment it turns dinosaur into bird amphibious mammals into whales and the ancestor of apes into humans animals who adapted the changes have been better suited these changes becomes inherited from generation to generation and new species with different characteristic may be created but due to some changes in environment the original species dies out and be becomes extinct means disappear the first scientist who gave us a systematic explanation of the concept concept of evolution was charles robert darwin in the year 1859 charles darwin proposed his theory of evolution in his book on the origins of species 
Darwin had not expressed any definite opinion about this relationship. His second book, The Descent of Man, he drew attention to the fact that even though humans do not have tail, the last bone of their spine is a vestige of a tail. He also noted that some other non-functional or unnecessary structures in the human body such as the wisdom teeth are indicators of the process of evolution. Children, in this slide you can see various species of dinosaurs which you can see only in movie, picture, magazine, picture books, etc. But in fact, all these species were alive in ancient time. But because of the natural calamities and physical changes in environment, they all extinct. Do you know children? In Greek, Dino means terrible or dangerous and sorrows means lizard or reptiles. So it was said dinosaur means terrible lizard because they were enormous big in size. But now we can't see all these various species of dinosaurs because they all were extinct due to changes in environment. Fossils of dinosaurs The species of dinosaurs which were enormous in size suddenly became to extinct due to some natural disaster or change. In the environment, all this you can observe in these two video and picture. The fossils of dinosaur with wings have been discovered in excavation. It is thus believed that some species of two-legged and winged dinosaurs evolved into birds. A reconstructed picture of a dinosaur with wings. Children, on screen you can observe picture of a reconstructed dinosaur with wings. Just observe the face of this bird. It resembles and looks like dinosaur face. So, due to changes in environment, and natural calamities, some species, some species of dinosaur change into video. And in this clip, you can see how the dinosaur were changed into bird. Children, in previous lesson, life on Earth, we learn. How life on earth begins with unicellular organism which is known as protozoa. This protozoa unicellular organism gave rise into multicellular living things and these multicellular organism develop slowly into various classes of plants and animals. Protozoa, also known as one cell animals, because they often possess animal like behavior. So, on your slide, you can see animal kingdom. It is divided into two unicellular animals and 
multicellular animal. So, in unicellular, it's come protozoa, and in multicellular, it's come metazoa. So, in metazoa, there is invertebrates and vertebrates. So, in invertebrates, animals such as snake, snake, snail, earthworm. And vertebrates, we found fishes, reptiles, birds, and mammals. Stages of evolution. Student, the stages of evolution is divided into two, such as invertebrates and vertebrates so let's see what are the differences and meaning of it invertebrates means animals without backbone or spine are called invertebrates animals such as snail snake earthworm etc so these animals are without backbone or spine. If you touch them, they curl their body easily. Now, let's see what is vertebrates. Animals which have backbone or spine are called vertebrates animals such as fish, dog, even human being. All these animals have backbone. Their body is divided into trunk and tail. Recap. So, what we learn in this lesson? We learn about meaning of evolution, various species of dinosaurs. Dinosaurs also means terrible lizard. Reconstructed dinosaur into birds. Stages of evolution and last we learn in vertebrates and vertebrates. Evaluation. Fill in the blanks. First, the word dash generally means a gradual and continuous changes. So children, the answer is evolution. Second, sometimes during evolution, the original species becomes dash. Answer is extinct. The first systematic explanation of the concept of evolution was given by Dash. So, the name of the scientist is Charles Darwin. Fourth, Dash means a terrible lizard. So, I explain you that in Greek it means by two words, dino and sword. So, it is dinosaur. Second, answer each question in one sentence. First, what does evolution means? Answer is evolution means a gradual and continuous changes which we have already seen in slide number 1 with the help of picture. Second, what changes occur in some species during the process of survival? Answer is in the process 
of survival by adapting to environmental changes. Certain internal physical changes occur in some animals of species. Next, how which species are able to survive? So, the answer is species which are capable of adapting to environmental changes are able to survive. Next, how did plants and animals come into being? So, the answer is unicellular organisms gave rise to multicellular organism which in turn gradually evolved into various classes of plants and animals. So this we see in our slide that is slide number 8 and in that picture we learn how it changes into unicellular to multicellular organism. Then give reason. The species of dinosaurs which were enormous in size suddenly became extinct. So what is the reason? The reason are the species of dinosaur which were enormous in size suddenly be became extinct due to some sudden natural disaster or environmental changes. So children this also we have learned in our slide in video where we can see how these dinosaurs are changes they transform into fossils. Next, birds form from dinosaur means how the birds are transferred into dinosaur. Answer is dinosaurs become extinct because of some sudden natural disaster or environmental change. Fossils of dinosaurs with wings have been discovered. It is thus believed that some species of two-legged and winged dinosaurs evolved means change into birds. So children, this also we have seen in our slide number 7 in video where you can observe that how the dinosaur have changed into birds. Thank you student.